what's going on guys welcome back to another video on the channel today we got a fun little rip the uh 2023 tops heritage baseball blaster box uh this is not the target one this is the one from walmart and of course ripping the top just so i can spare for viewership that we're not taking forever to open this box but uh, it should be fun we gotta look for one real autograph, so an on-card auto, and relic cards. So we can look for one of them, maybe we'll get one in this box. As well as the look for the 1974 Topps Baseball stamps. So that should be pretty cool, a lot of cool stuff in this set, an 800 card set, 500 of them are base cards. But with that being said, we're just going to get into it right here. Topps. Always a good good brand. I like tops pretty good. Heritage. I actually Heritage is one of the first baseballs sets that I actually opened. This is our pack design right here. Um, you know, throwback, classic baseball. I like it pretty good. Uh nine cards per pack, eight packs per box. I'm doing my math right. Let's see here. Looks like we got four. Yep, eight packs per box. And uh, the backs also have the classic design as well. So here's the um, the base card for Topps Heritage. Charlie Blackman right there. Um, yeah, it's got that cardboard type feel as the old ones. Back's pretty cool. Um, you know, the old classic stats, the old classic look to the other uh, 19... 1974 year but yep we're gonna get right in right here we got a uh, David Villar rookie Ian Happ a little sideways Adolis Garcia he's been doing pretty good this year game five so there's the uh, World Series insert right there not bad uh, Jeremy Pena Houston Astros top all-star rookie that's pretty cool Adam Seinberg, I think that's how you pronounce that. Pitcher Toronto. Yeah, with Topps Heritage, uh, pretty sure the hobbies are up there in the low hundreds at most. It's a pretty cheap product if you're just trying to look for a rip. Uh, retail is 25 Now, I don't know about resells or anything, but the actual resale price is or the retail i should say it's 25 so we got an adley rushman rookie card right there orioles that's not too shabby if i could sleeve this bad boy up there we go had a little bit of trouble right there uh we got new age performers george kirby Corey Seager and CJ Abrams. Yep, yeah, I think Adley Rushman's doing pretty good. I mean, he seems like he's making a definite impact there with the Orioles. My personal favorite rookie would be Corbin Carroll. Um, got another Orioles rookie, Kyle Bradish, Hunter Renfro. So it looks like you get about maybe one rookie per box, or one one rookie per pack, I should say. You got Jonathan India, Colton Wong, Mark Tanya, Evan Wood. Gloria, Yuri Rodriguez. Well, this is pretty cool right here. Looks like a, uh, this might be that baseball stamps right here. That's what it looks like to me. That's pretty cool. Uh, it's got Max Mayer on it, Jazz Chisholm, Sandy Alcantara, and JJ Blade. So this must be the, the Marlins one right here. Uh, I'm not exactly sure. This may be the stamps. I don't know. We'll have to come back and look at that. We got 2022 rookie outfielders, it's pretty cool. Javier Baez and Framber Valdez. Still looking for that 
hopeful autograph or relic card. We'll take either one, you know, out of a just a blaster. Jehuan Bay for the Pirates. Pretty cool. Got a uh, all-star first baseman here of uh, Paul Goldschmidt and Vlad Vladimir Guerrero. Alex Call rookie. Freddie Freeman. Another sideways right here. Earned run average leaders for the AL and NL. Got Nolan Jones rookie. Upside down card right here. Looks like flashbacks. World population reaches 4 billion. That's a cool little card, actually. News flashback. So I guess that's an insert. That's that's actually a pretty cool card. That's, that'd be something fun to chase. I like that a lot. But Topps Heritage, you can kind of get just about anything. That's what kind of makes it a little bit special. Uh, Topps Heritage, I'm pretty sure the 2020 version was my first ever taste for the um the tops part of the hobbies we got a Garrett Mitchell rookie it's pretty good right there we'll set him off to the side for right now Drew Jameson Aaron Judge Brandon Nemo Chris Bassett sideways G Mancho Miguel Cabrera All Star outfield that's a pretty cool card you got Ronald and Judge on the same card. And then rookie for the New York, Oswaldo Cabrera. We got two packs left here. Maybe if we're lucky, we can get a relic card or something going on. Doesn't look like we got it this time. So we got 2022 run batted in leaders. It's pretty cool. Uh, Rich Hill for the Pirates. Luis Ortez for the Pirates rookie card. It's not bad. The Aaron Judge special. That's a pretty cool insert right there. 2019 and 2020. Might have to hold on to that one. Uh, JJ Blade for the Marlins. Got 2022 rookie catchers from around the league. Louis Varlin. And Jordan Diaz. So that was actually a lot more rookies in that pack. I guess it just varies from pack to pack. Maybe this is a relic or auto in this pack. Hopefully so. You never know. Doesn't look like there's a memorabilia or a relic in here. So possible auto. Hopefully so. So we got Bryce Harper. Randy Ozarena. He's been doing pretty good. Joey Wendell. Kevin Gosman. Taryn Varvra, New Age Performers, Luis Arez, not RS. He's been doing pretty good this year. Then we got O'Neill Cruz, Shortstop, and Jeruxen Profar as our last card. So, kind of what you would expect from Topps Heritage. And we got a uh, Adley Rush, and that's always nice. Just a uh, base rookie card. Nothing too fancy, but uh, also, you know, when you get Topps Heritage, you're not really chasing a whole lot, you know. The Aaron Judge, this card's actually kind of cool. I like that. Uh, Luis Ortez, Oswaldo Cabrera, and Garrett Mitchell. So, uh, if you like any of these cards... Uh, you can check them out on the eBay store, the link in the description. Got this little sticker card too, or a stamp card, I guess you could say. But uh, that's going to do it all for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed. And as always, you guys are awesome, and I will see you all in the next one.